Hello, I am Zarkoon, and this is World of Warships Legends. Okay. Okay, I think we are live. I think this has been an odyssey getting this to work. I have been battling for like the past 30 minutes with the streaming software. But I think we're good. I think we are live and all is well. I just uh, could not, for the life of me, get the game audio to come through my headset. Took me like 20, not 20 minutes, more like 10 minutes to figure it out. But I finally gotten it figured it out. Hello, Dewan. EJ, hello. Hate it every time this software updates. It screws something up and then I've got to go through and fiddle with it. I have not finished Cosmic Terror level 5. I've only I I've only um gotten to 2, I think. Oh my god, there's only 2 days left. I don't think I'm ever getting that ship. I don't really care though. It's a tier 4. If, even if I did get it, I wouldn't play it probably. But today I think I want to start off the proceedings with the Minsk. I think this is, yeah, okay, it's true, Betskoy. But I was in a discussion, you see. Can't remember what Discord server it was in, but people were like, the Minsk. Man, I hate playing the Minsk. And I was like, why, why do you hate playing the Minsk? It's, it's so good. Top speed, look at that. With the speed flag in place, 44.3 knots. At tier 6, you got to be kidding, right? It's too good to be true. 12.9 km gun range. The turret traverse sucks, but it is what it is. So, yeah, I'm going to start off this stream with a game in the Minsk, just because. It could go terribly. It could go absolutely terribly, I'll grant you that, but it could go really well. Of course, you could say the same thing about literally any game that I'm about to play during this entire stream. It could go terribly, or it could go well. We hope it... Oh, my God. Yeah, we're, we're already starting off on the wrong foot, I see. I see here. We're off on the wrong foot, for sure. But at least we have the divisions. We've got... Wow, a balanced division. A destroyer, a cruiser, and a battleship. Who are these people? That's insane. They're taking out different classes of ships to work in tandem with each other? Is that legal in a division? Most of the divisions you see are like division number one here, double battleship. But no, this is a good composition. We should win this game, probably. Hello, Thunder One. It is Thunder One, right? That is the correct pronunciation. I hope. Otherwise, I'll feel like a fool. Comically bad turret traverse. That is true. The Minsk does have comically bad turret traverse, but it's a tiny little thing, and it's... Oh, and we... it has terrible concealment, of course, but that's due to my choices. All right, there's a uh, Russian DD. I think he's also Yeah, we'll do that. We'll give him a uh, we'll give him the old 1 2. He'll have to come out of that there smoke if he wants to spot me. And in the meantime, well, if we could land a shot, there we go. There we go. Oh, oh, he's he's going for it. Wait. 
what? There's two of them right here. That's not good. I don't need to be caught in this moss sonar. Thank you very much. Why are they both right here? That's annoying. And I got zero support. I guess we just wait for... How good is your concealment that you're spotting me? Jeez. Okay. Well, we don't... We don't need any of that. All right. Well, I can wait again. I've got patience. Now the carrier can't really do anything if they're in smoke anyway. I don't really know what our CV is doing, but... I guess I'll have to fight both of you myself. We're gonna go for the Kiev first, because I got my guns pointed that way. Oh, he gives up? Okay. Oh, you give up? Oh, he's shooting again. Stop it. Just let me kill you or just stop shooting. This is only going to end one way. Yeah. Look at them. They fear... Oh, here comes the CV. That's... Good. See this? They fear the power of the Minsk. We've got a Kiev and Moss. Neither one of them want to come try to... Okay, well, the carrier killed him. That's good. But anyway, because of the awesome power of this ship, neither one of them wanted to fight it. You see? They fear the power of the Minsk. See that? Moss had to take a shot from behind the island. He fears the power of the Minsk so much. He knows. He knows the power of the Minsk. Dunkirk doesn't know. Okay, he's clueless about the power of the Minsk. But, um... Going to do our best to, to educate old Dunker QB on the power of the Minsk. The unfortunate thing is my concealment is worse than my torpedo range. And it doesn't have to be that way. It's just I made it that way because of mortar. And we're not going to get torpedoes on him. So guns it is. Insta fire. Love to see it. Now, if only that moss was not able to shoot at me from cover. Oh, geez, I probably should have smoked up. So is the moss spotting me then? Yes, thunder. Thunder one. Maybe I should smoke up. Maybe not, though. Maybe I should use the engine boost. Oh, there you are. Leave me alone. I'm trying to harass your Dunkirk you. We've lost all our HP, but it's fine. It's not important. 
Read your message at the top. Hold on. There's a lot of text in that one. Multitasking is hard. Why are my... Oh, I know why. I knew this boss was gonna try this shit with his sonar. Ah, oh, shit. He's probably gonna kill me, too. It's like right here. Yeah. Well, maybe the Minsk does kind of suck. Maybe these torpedoes will kill him. Probably not, because he should see them with the sonar and dodge them easily. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like I did what I could for being the only ship on this flank with no support. Oh, now the CV comes. Now the CV comes to kill him. Yeah, now that there's not a Minsk between him and in that DD, now he wants to kill the Moss. I see how it is. I see how these fun police work. Anyway, he got 1979K. Six pack, Kraken, fireproof. Well, yeah, what are you going to do? I mean, you can do your best, but ultimately it is a team game. Let's go up to tier seven. I haven't gotten the Russian DD. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. I don't know what word I'm looking for. I... I'm at a loss for words, but I know what ship I'm looking for, and it's the Tashkent. It's been a while since I played the Tashkent, but I do want to check something. Wait, that's the Tashkent's camo? That's the permanent historical camo for the Tashkent? What's the difference between that and a naked ship? What? Is this a... This is not even a camo. That's a camo. This is the Tashkent's permanent camo? It's liter It's like literally nothing. What is it? Is the superstructure painted... A nicer gray than the rest of it? What the hell? All right. Well, I guess we'll just keep the black camo on then. Huh. That's disappointing. Oh, wait a second. We do want this. That's disappointing, though, isn't it? All these perma camos available now in the in the game and but no not for poor old trash can poor old trash can here just gets gray that's sad it's real sad i think i know a lot of the russian camos are pretty nice looking i thought for sure but nope I guess it just has to be black Tashkent, which is fine. Black looks good on everything. The the rust bucket camo should be the historical camo for the Russian ships? Probably, yes. I don't think the Soviet Union was exactly known for its tremendous navy. No, no, I don't think the Soviet Union was known for having the Navy. They were known for some other things. None of it good, either. Hello, Spartan. But yeah, they were not known for the Navy. They were known for bad stuff. 
real bad stuff. Didn't the the Russian Navy, this was before World War II, but they got into, Russia got into a war with Japan, and they were like, okay, we don't have any ships on that part of the world. We've only got them in the Baltic Sea. So what we're going to do is we're going to sail our entire Navy from the Baltic Sea all the way around the world to get to Japan. And so they did that, and unfortunately... They were so incompetent that when they met the Japanese Navy, they just lost. The Mikasa beat the shit out of them. And then they, they had to stop fighting the war. And that's where the story of the infamous Kamchatka comes from. Well, we're never going to outspot the DD that's in the cap with us, and I don't really want to push into a Prinz Ruprecht. Are those ghost shells, or do they damage me? Son of a bitch. Yeah, well, take that fire. Try that on for size, Ruprecht. See if you enjoy it. Heisens and whatnot. Oh shit. Dodging the Heisen salvo. Have to beach myself here. Oh. Yeah, it could have been worse. Alright. Get away from this island. Wow, is Ruprecht letting a single fire burn? That's good. I bet you have. Don't push into the cap yet. Kill the beached Ruprecht. Hello, Tiger Man. Oh, maybe you don't see ghost shells if you're on the receiving end. I don't know. That might be right. I don't know, because I don't think I've ever had a scenario where potentially ghost shells could be coming at me and then they hit me and don't do any damage, so who knows. What could this DD be? It's either a Lightning or Z23, both of which are bad. Why is, this, why is my other DD dead? How hard is this game? Really, though? He's right there. He's going to be able to get me with his damn sonar, probably. I'm going to die, actually. Maybe I'll be able to take this guy with me. Maybe. Maybe. Probably dead. Yep. God damn, I suck today. All right, no more Russian DDs. No more Russian DDs today. We need something stupid. We need a, a stupid ship to, with great power. The Ohio. That's what we need. Play Oleg. That's insane. That sounds like torture. Tier 2. Bovoy. Is that what you're saying? Is Are you saying Bovoy? The Conqueror. I haven't played the Conqueror in a long time. Maybe I should have picked that. That'd be easy to get some damage with. Is 
This doesn't look too bad. There's just Shima, Sumner, Hayate. One cruiser, of course, and the rest battleships. This... Is that a weeb? Hmm. Builds? I don't even know what I have. It's, I haven't played the Conqueror in a long time. I don't even know what I... Bovoy? Worst Russian DD? It could be. What tier is that? Four? Ganebni is, is five, right? Whoa, there goes my voice. Ganevni's okay. Yeah, Fisher's a good commander. I don't know that I've tried him on the Conqueror, but seems he's more specialized for the battle cruisers, which Conqueror is not. Oh, Bovoy is the alt tier 5 line. Okay. I don't like the alt Russian DD line. Just never clicked with me. I mean, certainly you... God damn it. Certainly you could use Madden, but I would not recommend the Brawler skill. Okay, so here's what we're going to do then. I wanted to turn out, but this guy's in my way. So now we're going to have to turn in and hope that no torps are incoming. Shit. There's Torps. Hopefully, we don't get wrecked in this turn. Yep. Exactly why I didn't want to turn in right there. It's almost like I could see all of that coming. And I wouldn't have lost any HP if that guy wasn't there, but now we're going to suffer. So this is one of the one of the culprits. Secondaries, get him. My God. Okay, can we finally go dark so I can do something? My gosh. Okay, finally. Holy Guaca fucking moly. I lost so much HP. We're gonna be silent on the guns for a second and try to drive the ship this way. Yeah, they are not um it's it's not going well so far, certainly. I'm sure it'll get better. I don't want to shoot at this Ohio yet. I want to see if he makes a turn. Maybe there's some broadside I can catch. I think he is going to make a turn. Is he? What is he doing? Is he going to turn into them? It seems somewhat inadvisable. It's a Kitakaze and Gearing. But do they have torps? They did lose vision of him. What the fuck? 
Why are all these enemy DDs doing this? What is this? What is going on? Is that an Henri the Fourth? Just light a fire on that DD. What happened to the Ohio? Well, Henry, or Henri, I guess, you can have some secondaries and some mains. Enjoy that. Yeah, yep, that's right. You better put yourself behind that island and stop spotting me. At least this Kitakazi is, like, on it. I think this Kitakazi was the one that told the Gearing to come help him kill the um, Shima on this cap, and now it looks like he's going after the Sumner. What a chad. What the actual fuck? Can I sail in such a way where I'm not getting blocked by... God damn it. <laughs> All right. It's, I, I don't know why, but it's a little bit tilting when you're trying to make a move and there's freaking friendly battleships blocking your path. Now, though, oh, no, we're going to get rammed. I thought he was beached. He's not. Fuck, he's going to try to ram me. I shouldn't have done this. Well, it doesn't matter. This game has been a terrible blowout for the red team. So if I do get rammed, oh, well. Maybe he's not going to try to ram. Is he going for... Oh, he is going for the drive-by, maybe. He's got those guns pointed the right way. I should have just rammed. He's going to kill me now? Almost. I do want to... Angle toward a Yamato. Wow, he's alive. Is that fire gonna get him? Nope. All right. Well, broadside Yamato. Front guns only. And he's turning in. And nothing. Our victory is in sight. But luckily our victory is in sight. Hmm. That does hurt. Might as well just drive straight into him. He'll probably kill me, but it'll be fine. Maybe I can get into secondary range and give him a couple of those. I don't even know what my secondary range is. 10.6? Okay. There we go. Priority target. that hit the yeah all right oh no Des Moines fire chance is better than Wooster's well this was a boring match at least we win, but what an ugly win. What a boring, uninspiring win.
Not terrible results either, but yeah, see, I told you, look at this Kitakazi. Wow. GG to him. Anyway, Conqueror. I mean, that's a ship I haven't played in a long time. I guess I've got Azerlay Nelson on here. That's probably fairly... I mean, it's probably a good build. Azerlay Nelson probably works. Play Conqueror. Conqueror is kind of a dumb ship. Maybe it could play Wusta or Des Moines. Shimanto? I'll play Shimanto. That ship's kind of... Well, it can be fun if you don't blow up. Conqueror, dumb is in easy. Dumb is in... I have 12.6 km concealment. 419 millimeter guns that can light people on fire with every salvo and I can go dark and they can't do anything back to me and then I've got a super heal on top of that. Dumb as in, I think this ship is broken. Nobody else does, but it kind of is. The HE is a little bit nuts. Yeah, I'll, I'll show them what we've got. I'll tell you what it, we've got. We've got 12 nearly dank British HE shells. That's what we've got. And I say nearly dank because these are, I think, 419 millimeter guns, not 420s. They're one millimeter away from being dank, but just don't quite meet the threshold. Alaska is good, there's no doubt about that. This island's kind of annoying. I'll just hold here for a second. See if these DDs spot something I can shoot at, and if not, I'm going to turn around and go that way. Oh, a Napoli. Oh, there is something in the cab. Which is, what is our Brisbane doing? He's got radar, doesn't he? I know he has radar. Well, he's chased the DD out of the cab, and there's nothing here, so I guess we'll push in on this flank. Because I think the entire enemy team might be going towards C. Oh, he's back in the cap. What are you doing? What is he doing? Okay. Well, there goes the Brisbane. GG's. I think he... Wow. It's a German battleship? Oh, well, I guess it doesn't matter. Literally every shell hits, or two of them. All right. And now our DD's dead. Kitakazi. What's that? All right, Napoli. I would not like to take any Yugamo torps. Thank you very much. Why is the Kitakazi still spotted? I don't understand. Is he shooting? Why is he doing that? Yeah, I was going to say, surely he's about to go dark, so we'll switch to AP and shoot at the Napoli. Or maybe Bat. What is that? Never mind. 
What's this? Kronstadt. That's good. Back to HE. Is Kronstadt going to use radar? Probably should have just kept the HE, honestly. Napoli's got armor. Armor that AP certainly cares about, but I don't think the HE will. No way. No way. Yeah, I should have just stuck with the HE the whole time. All three of our destroyers dead inside of five minutes. Most impressive. I have no idea. All I know... Devstruck? Did that say Devstrike? Maybe that bug. There was a bug where things were showing as dev strikes that were not dev strikes. I'm sure you do need intelligence data. But all of our DDs are dead. Was that like 10k to that Shima? Holy crap. I think that was like 10k. That That's painful. Oh, I used the heal too early. There's still going to be a couple seconds of this fire. Too bad. Yeah, all right. Close enough. Where are you, Napoli? Yes, there you are. No, 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 don't be turning now. Yeah, that Kitakazi. Is, is the enemy about to win? Is that what's is that what's happening here? Huh. You think I care about a fire, Napoli? I am the fire. Oh, come on. There we go. Probably should switch to the AP if he's just gonna do that. He probably thinks so. Oh, it's Conqueror shooting HE. No reason to angle. Okay, now that is that's a little too much now. Okay, we don't need that. All right. See, you think you're safe because you think I'm just a dumb conqueror that's just gonna shoot the high explosive, but no. Now you die to AP. Did this guy switch to AP? No. He does light a fire, naturally. But it's to be expected. Oh, shit. Napoli Torps. And, I and here I am with no DCP. Well, it is an opportunity to get an unsinkable metal, but not going to happen. It's fine, though, because we have literally no hope of winning this game. But, 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 but. Maybe I can do some mean things to these ships. Minnow is who I would like to shoot. Because I kind of wonder if this thing can citadel it with HE. Probably not, but... Eh. Unfortunate. Alright. End my suffering. 
Thank you, Mr. Muggin. Much appreciated. Well, it's all on these guys now. Did he just shoot H-E? Yep, those are some high explosive shells right there. Okay. Well, so this fucking sucks. Gonna go down to, I don't know, what should I play? Maybe uh, Shimanto. IJN, IJN, Shimanto, Shimanto, Shimanto. There we go. New mobile daily reward BB. What? Do they give daily rewards on mobile? And they're given a BB? Is that what that means? The game is 20 seconds from starting. How can you already need support? Tell a story about getting detention. I think I only ever got detention like one time. It was when I was in high school. I, it, was e it was a... What the hell was it? Oh, yes. It was an economy class. Oh, detonation. The reason I got detention, I'll just tell the story anyway because it was dumb. Because the economy class teacher, she was like, all right, you're, gonna, you're all going to have a test. It's like, okay. We're going to have a test. And then she's like, you need to study for the test. I'm like, okay. She's like, you need to you need to make flashcards of the key vocabulary words. And of course, I did not need to do that because I fucking know what words mean, okay? So I did I did not do that. And uh, I got a fine grade on the test, if I remember correctly, but she gave me detention for not making flashcards, which I thought was exceedingly stupid, considering I did well enough on the test without uh, doing what she told me to do. But she gave me detention for that, which is fucking dumb. But uh, that's the only time that ever happened. I don't hate them. I just thought not a useful way to uh, study if I, I can't even remember what stuff it was something to do with an economy class. It was who knows. It was over. It was a long time ago. So there's like a DD that's perma spotting me, I guess, and nothing wants to shoot at me, or nothing can. Oh. Wait, what's that? It's, oh, that's the Gnaiza now. See? Gnaiza now. Gnaiza now. What a. What a sad ship. Did that Richelieu seriously DCP a single fire? He's probably not even going to get punished for it. Well, maybe. Nope. Wait. Nope. He's out of our range. Would be nice if I could push in here, but... Okay, well, at least we're able to go dark. 
Oh, okay. Um, F. Can I even avoid this? Nope. All right, well, that could have been worse, though. Jeez, deep water torpedoes are terrifying. Very, uh, very alarming that that DD is out on the flank. What's our Udachi doing? He's, oh no. I don't really want to go back out here. Yin Yang. At least if I push in, he won't spot. There's no way I'm going to hit him from this kind of distance, but... Yeah. All right. Riga's coming in. This will turn and wait. how you turn the Shimanto into Mysore. <laughs> I'm honestly surprised that torpedo didn't do more. Well, hey, at least the Udachi's over there. He's taking B, he's gonna take C now. I'm gonna put torpedoes this way, because maybe. Maybe if the uh, Peter Bag Ration tries to turn into the cap, maybe those will hit. Or the Riga. I mean, maybe the Riga will, whoa. Maybe the Riga will like, think he should get all his guns on target or something why don't you why don't you make a little turn and not that way maybe probably not god these shells are floaty oh wait wait Bilbo bag ration, are you gonna... Does he know the torps are coming? He probably knows the torps are coming. Eh, fire. Can we stay on the bag ration? There we go. That is a perma fire, I think. Oh God, Jesus H Christ! Not a very good game in the Shimanto. the time or not well I guess we're gonna win this is the CN Yang like allergic to the cap that's nice should go 
dark here. I don't think... Yeah, there we go. All right. All right, you... That's not going to hit. You picked it up in a book. Noob Muffin. You did not pick that up in a book. You made that up. I do not believe any book contains that term. Maybe. Oh, shit. Is he going to turn the other? Nope. Okay, well. One day I'll aim well. Is this Bismarck seriously shooting at the Odin and not me? Probably shouldn't complain. I don't know, more... More torpedoes. More torpedoes. Bismarck? That'll do a little bit of damage. Surprised the Riga has not shot at me. Probably ought to turn on this stupid... Why does this thing get 60 seconds sonar, though? What's so special about this sonar that, can, that it can only last for one minute? That's what I want to know. What is so great about this sonar. It's like so powerful it can only be 60 seconds. It's like GK. Oh, is it because it has 6km ship detect? No. We're not detecting this guy. Alright, alright. 23 seconds. That should be enough time to figure out the detection of ships. Four. Four. And we get 60 seconds. Huh. I, I've i played the Shimon. I need to still do a video on it, but I've played the Shimanto enough times that I've used, you know, the sonar. Done it enough times that I've used the sonar, but wow. Second, on, I feel like I didn't do anything, but okay. But what? Yeah, this 60 second duration. Reloads in 107 seconds. 4.3 km ship detect. Why should it be 60 seconds? What's the Mogami sonar? What the f... Okay. Maybe... Th is that why? 96 second duration, but 180 second reload time. Whereas this has a 107 second reload time. Are any of my commander skills making it reload faster? That's weird. Maybe that's why. Just doesn't seem to make much sense to me why it should have a 60 second sonar duration. What an oddity. What can you replace the defensive AA with? Oh, a plane, who cares? Yeah, that is Brutus. He's doing a little stretch, doing a little stretch on the ground now. I think, you know what I haven't really played since the buff is the Hawk, but this got buffed. It's it's. Gun reload got shorter or something, right? Ah, 20... 27 second reload. 
even better if we lose HP. All right. Brutus was, in fact, doing um, the downward dog, as they say. I think that's where the yoga pose comes from. Being a stretchy dog. And I picked him up. Now he's sitting with me on the chair. All right. The Fallout show, I, I would be very skeptical of that. It's just a yoga pose. Yeah, he's he's a small little dog. He's a he's like a Chihuahua mixed with a Jack Russell Terrier or something. He mostly just kind of looks like a Chihuahua. The only problem is because he's mixed with a Terrier, he's a lot fucking heavier than a Chihuahua is. And after a while, I've got him sitting on my lap, but after a while, it gets tiring. Play mice? Yeah, I could play that. How much battery do I have left on this thing? Okay, good. For him or for, probably for both of us. All right. Stop here, see what happens. Mysore is the tier five thing, right? I think so. Oh, and hi, Muse. I, I saw you there. Oh, okay. Nope. Thinking at some point our DD will spot something. Because there's no way the enemy team abandoned this flank. That would be unprecedented. Is Bismarck reversing? Well, I've seen everything now. Apparently the enemy team has completely abandoned this flank. I have no idea what reality we're living in. Okay, I should have probably aimed that better. Where did they send all their big boats? Send them to A? There's a moss. HE would be preferable here, but we shoot what we have, I suppose. Probably would have been better with the HE, but it is what it is. Can I hit that Cleveland? I think I. Oh, no, never mind.
Oh, our Akatsuki got pummeled. Can I shoot the Mas? I missed. Hmm. I've never seen a game on this map play out quite this way. This just seems highly unusual to me. Oh. There's the Bismarck. He's about to come this way trying to take care of business. But no. Oh. We'll get this guy. See if maybe he does take a turn. A couple Hawk torpedoes for the Bismarck. Is that double Cleveland? The hell? Can't remember the last time I've seen a Cleveland in a match, much less two of them at the same time. Ah, oh, Chappie, you took one of my torps. All right, so this Cleveland says, nope, we're getting out of here. This Cleveland says, yeah, let's push straight in. It's fine with me. Now there's Benson. Is he, what, can I hit him? HE perhaps? Wow, the, the dispersion on this thing maybe leaves a little bit to be desired. Um, shit, is that Benson about to... No way. No way he kills the Chappie. Right? Oh my god. Oh my god. Azerlane Chapayev, what... Uh, what a piece of shit ship. Can't even, can't even fight a Benson. That's, man, they need to buff that thing, I guess, right? That's the correct conclusion to draw from having witnessed that, right? Uh, hopefully Bismarck doesn't absolutely wreck me here. I figured that might happen. It's fine, though. Speed is my armor. Do these torps do it? Looks like they will. <laughs> Alright. What about the Benson, though? What the hell am I going to even do about that? What am I going to do about the Benson? Our destroyer is just not going to be able to do anything about the Benson. I myself do not want to get torpedoed by the Benson. Okay, so the Benson does not see me. I mean, I'm telling you, you saw the same thing I did. You all saw that Benson just mercil mercilessly execute that A.L. Chapayev. Just complete, cold, merciless death. And it's like, wow. Wait, where are the torpedo? Oh, okay. That's kind of what I figured would happen. 
And I'm wondering if it was the wrong time to switch to the AP, but I don't think I'm going to get a shot. No, I'm not. Or am I? What is he doing? He wants me to get a shot? Ah, the island. Always the island. Engine boost deactivated. 15 km lasting 5 minutes, that seems like it'd be a reasonable buff. Can we kill the Cleveland? I don't know if they've got another radar cruiser aside from that, but... I don't know. You, what is the what is that guy doing? He's like touring the islands or something. Is our Jaeger in mortal danger? I think it might be. The Benson, though. I mean, do you think he's still in the smoke screen? Kansas is running at him. Well, I do have an idea. We get spotted by a plane, but not by sea. Interesting. Oh, the Jaeger killed the uh, Cleveland. I was going to drive this way and try to kill the Cleveland so it didn't get the Jaeger, but apparently he did not need me to do that. So I guess we'll kill the York. I don't know. I just, I don't want to drive into the Benson. I don't know where it's at, so. We'll just drive this way and fight the cruiser and maybe the battleship. What is it anyway? Ruck. Okay. I who doesn't know what I'm they're doing? Me? That might be true a lot of the time. I really don't know what I'm doing in this particular match, I'll be honest with you. It's it's a weird one. Oh, who are you talking about? Former CCs? Oh, do we get to yoink this? Yes. There we go. There we go. That is three hard-earned kills. Three hard-earned kills in this match. Incredible damage numbers. 88,000. And an opportunity for a Kraken. Unless the Kansas kills the Benson. But I am reasonably confident I can kill the Rook. I'd appreciate it if he would not turn that way, though, but... Mm. Well, we can't kill the Rook if the Torpedus is going to kill the Rook. God damn it. No Kraken. If I had got the killing blow on that rook, I could have come this way and then killed the Benson. Oh. Kansas is fine. Benson torpedoes are slow. Yeah, Hawk is good.
Oh, I've, I've taken two caps. I've taken two solo caps with this thing. What the hell is this game? Two solo caps in a battle cruiser. Wow. What did Benson do? Just cross the gap there? Probably torpedoes are coming at my face. Oh, he went behind that island. He's blind firing. Not completely off, honestly. But I mean, come on. You got 30 seconds left in the game. You just, like, shoot me where you can see me and die. Meh. Okay. I'll take it. That was a decent result. It was very decent. Maybe I should play a ship I haven't played in a long time. Oh, jeez. Wow, look at that. Very, very close to... 81 out of 100, still 17 days left to go in the campaign. Not that the reward is all that great. It's another one like this that's probably just going to sit in port. Carno. Well, I did say I wanted to play something I haven't played in a long time, didn't I? Is that tier 8? Yeah. Yeah, Carnot I haven't played in a long time. Oh, I have an epic mod on there, though. That might be better used elsewhere, but we can try the Carnot. What could you trade out the engine boost for? Oh, that's dumb. Why would you want to ever trade that out for a 20% engine boost for a plane? No, no, no. No, no, no. All right, well... It's French, so it needs a speed flag. Have I got the Columbo yet? Yeah, I could play that next. I just got it the other day. Yeah, I, I've taken Carnot out, and I've gotten some lovely, fantastic salvos out of these guns, but they are in no way consistent, and it just kind of feels like a lemon to me. But, I don't know. Sometimes you get a ship. There's so many damn ships in this game. Sometimes you get a ship and you think, this thing sucks, and then you take it out a couple months later and you're like, I, I was wrong about this. Now, probably, probably we're not going to get proven wrong about thinking the car no is not that great in this match but who knows I was wrong about this the Azuma story well no because I was right about the Azuma being pretty mediocre when it was first released they buffed it into something excellent I would never say no to playing Kaba, although I did start this stream with two awful games in the Minsk and Tashkent back-to-back, -back, so I clearly don't have the Russian DD thing going on today, but I could try it. I've got this AP loaded in hopes that we will spot a broadside cruiser before anything else. Actually, the concealment on this thing isn't bad for how big of a ship it is. It's gigantic and it's got 11.3 detection. That's pretty good. Oh no. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I think the Schroeder was in a division with a second one, wasn't he? Yeah. So I suppose they're both right there. They're going to try to do their secondary nonsense, aren't they? I think a DD must also be spotting me. And it may have to be the HE for this, because I don't think this AP will do anything. Hmm. Yeah, 940 is not gonna... Not gonna work any wonders. Oh, wait. What are you doing? You should certainly continue with that turn. Or you should go the other way. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, that was that initial broadside was the wrong one. So you got to you got to give me the right one. There you go. Well, okay. Time to give up on the AP, I think. Yeah, definitely time to give up on the four times ricocheting AP. All right. All right. The Schroeder, you know, he's German. He's like, I got cool secondaries. Are you shooting HE at him? Schultz, come on. Come on, Schultz. He's broadside to you. Use the smart shell, Schultz. Stop shooting HE at him. Well, all right. It's fine, I guess. What's his division mate doing? I guess we can push in. All the rest of the team, besides the gearing and the Schroeder, are over on the other side of the map. Can I get the gearing? This is an awfully long reload on these guns. I feel... I just feel like they are too inaccurate for the reload to be this punishing. Is this guy playing the game? He is. Maybe if I go... Oh, he's shooting AP. Maybe if I go quickly, I can get his broadside. What the fuck? That was all. I mean, that was a lot of damage. Like, all his shells penned. That's insane. How dare you? You're gonna take some, some of this French AP now, Schroeder. You're gonna take it and you're gonna like it probably is going to like it because it's going to do zero damage. Is he going to beach himself? Why are you going to stop? That seems like a bad idea. Okay, well not zero damage, but close enough. What the hell? What is he doing? Wow, I lost so much HP to that guy. That's insane. Just 
force loss. Wait, what an over... Really? Really? Okay, so you can Citadel a main at 14 kilometers, but you can do zero damage to a fucking Schroeder? What is this ship? I didn't like it when it first came out, and this is just reinforcing my opinion. Uh-oh. Secret ships. Secret sneaky ships. I cannot believe this thing can just citadel a main. part of the... Oh, shit. Can I avoid that one single torp right there? No, the ship is too big. The ship is just too big. And... Okay. Should go dark, yes? Okay. Hello, Shimakazi. Haha, <laughs> chased him out of his smoke screen even though my sonar ran out. Now he's regretting it. Well, we win. We win the match with this crappy ship. What was I supposed to play after this? Cannot remember. Kaba. Right, okay. Look at this little Schultz. These little guns. Oh, shit. I was about to ram him. Yeah, see? Look at that. Columbo, definitely the best. Oh yeah, and I was supposed to play Columbo too, so I guess Kaba and then Columbo, that's how it'll go. There's Columbo. But there's Kabarask. Kabarask. Oh dear, hopefully this doesn't go as well as the Minsk and the Tashkent games earlier. Well, at least there's no fun police. Oh my, holy fucking Schlieffen. Oh my god, what is this? It's like all the same player. And then we have a Conqueror and Yamato division along with GK, Yamato, and Ala Alaska? Hmm. That is a triple Schlieffen division. I wonder how that's going to work. Okay, good. I'm not the only DD. 
want to go off on one of these flanks a little bit instead of going right in the middle, but I feel like... What is our DD? I feel like our Hayate is not moving. Just see if I spot anything here. We're gonna have to turn in and go toward the center though because our fucking Hayate is not playing the game. Conqueror, Alaska, right there. This is probably a bad idea. Normally you don't want to turn in front of islands if there's a possibility that you can get spotted, but when the enemy team... Oh my god, are you serious? When the enemy team has taken the center ring, what, where is our Hayate? Oh, there's one of the Schliefens. Okay, never mind. I don't want those secondaries. Thank you. Thanks, but no thanks. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Thanks for the consideration of your secondaries, but no. No thank you. I don't want those. Okay, now we take this ring and then we go into the center. And then we farm, I guess. Gotta gotta do the DD work before you can do the farming Kabarosk things, I suppose. Oh. That's probably a dead Shima. I think I missed, but... Oh, I, I did hit him. Okay. All right. All right, things are okay. Did both teams look at the epicenter in the middle of this map and think, oh yeah, these circles are where we're not supposed to go? Must be what happened. Must be what happened. All right. Farm the triple Schlieffen threat. Don't get hit by their infernal secondaries. How dare you. How far does the second... You know what? Take the cap before farming the Schlieffen. That's the correct play. Should go dark, right? Yeah. Maybe. Gotta run away. Wonder what these guys are doing. Imagine if the Hayate had gone to the center of the map. What effect he could have with his... Where is the Hayate? Is he still alive? What are these guys doing? Do they realize the Schlieffen Brigade is incoming? We're going to lose this game to a fucking red team with triple Schlieffen.
six minutes, five ships dead. Rain of Schlieffen secondaries. Can we kill this Schlieffen maybe? I... This may possibly be the single most pathetic performance I've ever seen out of any blue team. and secondaries really aren't as big of a problem as I had feared. This one needs to heal. Can I lock onto that one? The other one's already got a fire. Where the hell is our last battleship? It's over there. Maybe I'll give one of these Schlieffens a close quarters expert here in a second. But I feel kind of content to just farm and whatnot. Cold bear. This is a fairly depressing match, you know? Party's over now. Which Leafin gets the secondary skill kill? Oh no, not the not the Colbert. Wait a second, what's that? Smalland? Shoot at him. Oh no, I won't. Did he kill me with his main guns? Come on. Kill me with the secondaries, at least. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. Triple Shalifin. That, um, that was painful. So you know what we're going to do? Is we're going to say, convert these into five flags. We're going to get maximum gun range Kaba at 15.4. And I'm going to try that again. Because that was really unsatisfactory. You know? Hello, Gazpaccio11. That was one of the saddest matches I've ever, uh, I've ever been a part of. Almost brought a tear to my eye. Ooh. I like that clan name. Tool. It's the name of a very, very good band. Surely you all in the chat have heard of the band Tool, but if you haven't... All right. So I think I'll go over to B. You mean to tell me you've never heard of the band Tool? 
with the famous lead singer Maynard James Keenan, also of A Perfect Circle and Pussifer, and the drummer Danny Carey, a god on the drums. Tool's first album. I like um, their first album is fine. It's good. But Lateralis, I think that's their third. That is my favorite. Yeah, Opiate, Anima was the second. Lateralis, 10,000 Days, and finally, a couple years ago, that new one, Fear Inoculum. They don't have a bad album. Lateralis is just my favorite. The only sad thing is I've never seen Tool live in concert. And I would like to. I would like to. But I have seen a perfect circle. And that was pretty good. All right. We're going to have to try to do something about that Kaba. But yeah, I've seen a perfect circle. It was at Lollapalooza in 20... 2011, Jesus Christ. It's a long time ago. Is this a smoke, Kaba? Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. This is not... Spot him again, because this is not how you play Kabarosk. You don't use smoke. Oh, shit. All right. There it is. Yeah, that's right. Straighten it out. Straighten it out. Yeah, you don't smoke up in Kabarosk. I guess we'll go to the other DD. Surely you're not shooting at me, GK, right? Yeah. I'm aware. There's a perma fire, I think, on GK. I bet I bet you have, Mr. Ohio. I bet you have. Cause it turns out there is a DD in this cap. And he's, like, right behind that island. Farming of the GK. Got to get enough fires in time for the HP harvest. We just need to not turn into this DD and take a bunch of torps. Oh, my God. It's a Kabarosk. What the fuck? Torping me? Oh, you fool. Oh, he's gonna turn away from my torps, though. He's probably torping me. Okay. Well, we've seen two perfect examples of how not to play the Kabarosk. Maybe I can demonstrate the proper methods. Maybe not, though. Yeah, 
es el fuego. Oh my f lord, daring just spot them. Oh, okay. Is he like blind firing at me? Oh no. He's probably pissed. You can understand. He's been lit on fire many times. He's just dying though. Yeah. What are you gonna do when your all your three of your destroyers are dead? You can't see anything. Oh. Dave Grohl is, uh, yeah, Foo Fighters are good. Wow, what a shitty game. Just got to kill one and a half Kabas, and that's, that's about it. Sad. Maybe, uh, farm... Something? Minnesota? I mean, he's slow. Oh, wait. Is the Minnesota dead? So it's just GK and dead Columbo? Huh. Uh, can I actually hit the GK? I think I can. Is he AFK? He's not moving. I think he uh, is AFK. Yeah, he, um, okay. So I guess I'll shoot at the Alaska then. Yeah, oh, you're the one that sent me your um, your Twitch channel. I followed it, but I'm not on Twitch that much. Well, not true. I was on Twitch yesterday. I was watching Potato Quality's stream for the WoW's PC. And sometimes on the weekends, I tune in and I watch Flamu's streams on Twitch. Not bad, I suppose. Not bad. Okay, anyway. Columbo, then. We'll go there. Hopefully we'll get a... Good game. Who's going down? You're surprised we won. Oh, yeah, that was a really close game, right? It was down to the wire. Clearly anybody's, uh, anybody's match. Could have gone either way for sure. Oh, my God. Herd of baby ducks. Well, I guess that uh, precludes me from saying fuck a duck during this match. Oh yeah, I've seen some some videos of Axel Rose. Oh man. 
It's too bad too, because he's old now, and it's like he's back with Slash and all them, which is cool. But he like uh, he can't sing anymore. Well, he can if you if you hear him on some of the lower songs, you know, like that. Where do we go? Where do we go now? That part of Sweet Child of Mine, he can sing that. He just can't sing the um, the higher parts. It's too bad. Oh, shit. I don't want to push directly in. I might actually use a smoke. It's probably a bad idea, but I am broadside. Oh, right, I forget this thing has stupid smoke firing penalty. Maybe Carl Johan. Nah, I'm all right without a division. Oh, my God. Yeah, Carl. I'm sorry to tell you. Sorry to tell you, your armor is not very good. Is this Columbo? Not broadside enough. What is that camo? Oh yeah, I um before Ozzy, I think I can turn in and probably push in. I just don't want to run straight into the Carl. I think I um before Ozzy, you know, he's like he can't. I don't think he can perform anymore. He's just too fucked up. But before that time, back in the late 2010s, I saw Ozzy Osbourne twice. Uh, and I saw Black Sabbath twice with Ozzy. And, like, he's old and stuff, but he was still able to put on a good show, and his, his voice sounded fine. Yeah, there's no audience, really, for this... for Legends, anyway, on Twitch. There's, there's plenty of people watching WoW's PC stuff on Twitch, but not so much Legends. Where the fuck did these torps come from? Oh, there's... Oh, there's a DD literally right there. Shit. I think I might be dead now. Unless... What is that... What is that DD that just hit me with those... torps? Is those... Oh, shit. I'm broadside. We're going to have to take Columbo out again. I've I done fucked up. Good uh good Carl. Carl Johan. Poor Carl. It just gets wrecked. Uh, okay. Oh, right. That's what did it. That's why the torps didn't hurt that much, because it's just a Z-46. Has Wargaming ever said how Carnot performs? I don't know. I'm sure if you asked blip on discord or something he'd be able to say la pants
I don't think I really want to pay any attention to that Columbo. I think I want to go more toward the center of the map now. I don't think there's any point in pushing into that Columbo. I do think there's probably a point in going toward the center, though. Why does this ship feel slower than hell? It does feel slower than hell. Maybe we will push into the Colombo then. Or wait, we'll get Lepanto. Lepanto. Well, Lepanto's dead. But it's 3v5. 3v5. I lost all my HP. But maybe that DD can kill that battleship. We have to try and kill Columbo and Carl, I guess. Carl. How much HP does that guy have? A lot? My god. Oh no! Fucking Carl! God damn it, Carl! Oh no, Columbo's just gonna fuck me up. Oh, he does have sonar, right? Fuck. I was gonna, like, turn broadside and shouldn't do that. I'm gonna die to his torps or something, watch. Die to his guns, even worse. Oh no, I'm gonna die to his guns. I'm gonna die to Columbo's guns. Yeah, we're gonna have to try that again. Let's see. How quickly will this guy die? Do I just wait and take it out into another? He's gonna die pretty much instantly. And then the DD, he's gonna die. Maybe not. Whoa. Does he get the other DD? Oh, nope. Too bad. Too bad. I want to get a good game in Columbo. But then maybe I'll play the... The what? The Z35? Is that the new Tier 6? I haven't actually ever played that one. I've only played the Merker, the... And the Schultz. Alright. So, Conqueror is dead, yeah? Okay. So, Conqueror is dead... Clebert, I mean, he could get a solo warrior, but, I mean, no. It's just not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. Oh, the Clebert's like, good work. Yeah. Sorry, little Clebert. You're a Chad, but, well, all right. I don't really want to wait until the Kleber dies, so we'll leave the battle. Maybe he'll pull out a epic victory of some kind. But I think tier six. Oh, Z35, okay. Z31 is what I was thinking of. That's the new ship. But what is what's the deal with Z35? It has 5km sonar. What kind of build do I have on this thing? I've got a gun build. What's my conceal? 5.8. 9km torpedoes. This is probably more a torpedo boat than it is a gun boat. Maybe not. 
I don't know. We'll take it with the Eric By gunboat build. Oh, thank you for the feedback, Isaac. And okay. Ugh. Sorry about that. Let us slay. Let us try to slay. Oh, I don't... You don't have to delete Isaac's messages. Do you think I care what he thinks? <laughs> no, it's fine. I, I really do not care. You, I mean, if you're watching this stream and that's all you're watching, I wouldn't blame you for thinking I don't know how to play this game, to be honest with you, because we have seen some real doozies, some of them being my fault, like that Columbo game. So, I mean, it's not an unreasonable thing to think if this stream's the only thing you've ever seen. Don't worry, it'll get worse. <laughs> You're going to fight him in a Chili's parking lot. All right. I just don't want to make a practice of banning people who say that they don't like me or whatever. Because the a couple, like a while ago, somebody was in this stream chat, and they were like, fuck you, Zarkoon. You, you're... The Lord is censorship over here. You're banning anybody who disagrees with you. And I'm like, are you fucking smoking crack, you idiot? Or like, are you living in a different reality, you know? I, I think you're confusing me with somebody else. But who knows? You're going to have haters everywhere. Yes, see if he comes comes back. But yeah, wonder if we'll get any uh torp. Oh shit! I probably uh should not get spotted. Oh look at that! Are you serious? Every single one. Every single one missed. Well, if he's a perfect ten and he's smoking up, that means he doesn't have radar, I guess. So. Of course, I don't think I can pen him at that angle. Maybe a little bit. HE it shall have to be. Oh, I was like, why? I forgot I got that moist critical guys on here. I was like, what the hell? Um, it's probably not where you want to be, Fletcher. Thank you, T-Man. Some Kleenex. Probably need about 10 bucks to buy one of those boxes with inflation. But yeah, thank you. That uh, makes the sting less acute from that match. Okay, can we kill this uh, Fletcher? Can we kill him? I 
guess he outspots me a little bit then. Wait, where the fuck? Oh, there he is. Jesus Christ. How are you even supposed to play this game when the when all these ships instantly die? Is he still going? Oh, he stopped. That's unfortunate. I'll tell you one thing, though. Does it matter that I lost vision at the NC? Maybe that'll make him go forward. Um, I'll tell you one thing, though. You see how long I've got until this smoke screen comes up? One minute still. German smoke really is trash. It really is trash. Um, I think he's probably gonna die. Ooh. What's that? Oh, never mind. I don't know about well mannered, sometimes I'm a little mean. I think I am sometimes anyway. Not like super mean. Well. Oh goody, be able to smoke up soon. Vladivostok. Should I smoke up? Yep. Yikes. Whoops. Probably gotta aim a little bit higher. Now gotta run away from Flanders. Oh, that's good. I forgot about those. That is good. That is ideal. In a condescending, nerdy kind of way? Okay. Uh, I'll take that. Can we get Torps on this thing? Come on. Come on. I think this lightning is about to about to find out he probably shouldn't be sitting there the hard way. Yeah, he's he's finding out in a really rough rough way. Man, this thing is slow. Okay, he did he did hit the Flanders pretty good. I okay, never mind. Oh, Vladdy. Vladdy Vostok. Don't run into the fucking island. Can I go dark? Thank you. Thank you, game. Oh, he did get to shoot though. Yeah, that hurts a little bit. Does hurt a little bit. Ooh, instant fire too. How broken are you? Z thirty five, what a powerhouse. Oh, so I'm still spotted. That's interesting. 
What is it? Moss, right, right. This is the second time we've seen Epicenter game mode today, I think, on this map. Concentrate fire on the North Carolina. I, I don't have one. I'm sorry, York. I don't have a smoke screen for you. I've used them all. And even if I did have a smoke screen, it would be a shitty German smoke screen. You don't want a shitty German smoke screen. You want a Chad American smoke screen, but unfortunately none are available. All right. It was the other one, not Gokase, the, um, Omono. It was that one. I have not actually played the Gokase thing yet. Maybe I should do that next battle. Now that you say that. Shoot me and see. Oh, that's pretty sad, though. It does have to feel a little bit painful. Ooh, finally got a kill. Wonderful. And the results say very good. Very good. Well, decent in any case. All right. Tier four? Is it the tier four? IJN. No, that's the Agano. Tier four is Agano, or however you pronounce it. Tier five, though, is that Gokase? Shinonome? Oh, apparently, yeah. Yeah, tier five is Gokase. Maybe I have. No, I, I haven't played it, have I? Oh, I played it once. Or twice, or something. I don't remember playing it. But alright, I'm going to take it out. Clearly cracked. And Carl? And Carl? You had a Kraken in your first match in the Carl? Shit, I must be completely wrong about that ship. It's clearly broken, then. My god, cracking in the carl. Fun police. Look at this. Carl. You love my voice? People say that sometimes. I don't get it. I think my voice just sounds like a normal voice.
Oh, a Nelson. A Nelson, and what's this? Jadis. All right. Did you end up getting any ships besides the Gokase? And also, are you ever, are you ever coming back to the program? That's fine. I was, I hated the Carl. I was enjoying the Dyson before they took it away, but everybody says that ship sucks, so. Very polarizing update. Gokase versus Gokase. Does the AP do anything? I bet it doesn't. I bet it doesn't do anything. Does it do anything at all? Oh my god, a citadel. This is amazing. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe this AP can citadel other tier 5 cruisers. Amazing. Because I've tried the AP on the higher tier ones, and it seems like it doesn't do shit. But maybe that's because they've all got much better armor at the higher tiers. Veribus Unitus, or however you pronounce the name of that particular vessel. Uh, that one sucks. It's bad. I think uh, probably... I mean, it's a good eyes now, right? What's the worst that can happen? Fucking A... Can I dodge this torpedo? Yeah. Okay. But yeah, if it's a Ganais now, what's the worst that can happen, right? Although, you know what, I really don't think I, I like that the Ganaiza now is this close, actually. So, probably increase the distance. Mm, maybe another set of torpedoes. I guess I'm not really doing much to increase the distance. And besides, it's a Ganais now. They can't hit anything. And he's got this Nelson to contend with. Don't, uh... Just don't switch to AP. How about that, Nelson? Let the torpedoes kill the Ganais now. Actually, they probably won't. I think he's maneuvering. I guess that explains why I'm not allowed to get any fires on the Ganais now, because the Nelson is getting them all. But I think I broke HE. He shoots HE at the Nelson. That's like a sign of desperation, I guess. Very sad. Okay. Time to go over to the Charlie Cap, I suppose. I don't think we need to chase the Monahan. Monahan. It's a fun word to say, Gnaise now. Unfortunately, it's not. It's more fun to say the word than it is to play the ship, I think. It's a sad state of affairs, but it is what it is. Are the turrets? I think the turrets are 360, right? Yeah, that back one is. The very back one. Are both the front two? Yeah, the front two both are. Hmm. 
It's a characteristic all up and down the line. Bunch of 360 turrets. Uh, putting an epic reload mod on... On what? I don't think... I don't think it'll be a problem if I drive. I bet this thing has stupid short sonar duration, though. I bet it's 60 seconds, like the Shimanto. That's probably why we get four of them. When you hear yourself, you're the best singer in the world. Yep, 60 seconds. Why, though? I don't get it. I probably um, should not have come out there broadside like that and just announced myself. It's fine, though. It's all good. That was a suicidal move, to be sure, but we didn't get punished for it, so it's fine. Now we must kill the moss. Oh no, you little, little DD. smoke firing penalty is like if I shoot at the West Virginia do I get spotted by the moss no wait a minute wait a minute though are you telling me this thing has eight torpedoes oh okay eight down the center line I'd love to push into that moss, but I just can't. Not with this West Virginia. What's this behind me? Oh good, the Nelson. He can probably deal with the West Virginia. Oh, there's the moss, okay. And I think... God damn it, Brutus, you are gonna fall off my fucking lap. Brutus is like, oh. Did he just get hit by the CV? Oh shit, is the Nelson beached? It's not ideal. But I don't think West Virginia can see him in any case. Double perma fire, I think, there. That's good. All right. Oh, my fucking God. It's a Russian CV. I didn't even realize. 
Oh, wait, did he beach himself? What is the other battleship? No way. He DCP'd before my fire killed him. At least the CV got him. So I guess we'll just take our home cap again and then go to sea. I don't know. It's just me and this Nelson and... I can tell you one thing about Nelson, it does not have AA. I don't think this this ship does either. We need subs that can only torp CVs. No, subs are bad. Subs are they are not fun. I don't think so anyway. All right, take this cap. Come on, before this guy kills me. All right, did get the cap. Oh, are you talking about Isaac Muse? I don't care. I don't even know why he popped in here. Needs mines and minesweepers? Yeah, that would be good for the game. Oh my god, I think the Ashitaka... Well, no, the Nelson can kill the Ashitaka, probably. We'll just take the cap. That's what we'll do. Yeah, the Ashitaka's dead. We'll take the cap. You know, just farm some XP and whatnot. Try to just dodge this CV. Oh, he's not even coming for me? You're not going to try to tort me with my 4,000 health? You're going to go for the Nelson? All right. I think I would torp me or something. Because then he could get the kill and then go for the Nelson. I shouldn't complain. Never complain when the CV is not focusing you. Just be grateful. Oh, now he's... Unless he's not... What are you, what's he doing? Is he trying to get the... Ooh, do the planes get him? Do the planes finally do something worthwhile? Yeah, no thanks, Serov. I don't need any of those skip bombs. Thank you. Ten planes shot down, though. Eleven. Unfortunately, I do believe he may... S oh, no, never mind. I was thinking he was going to survive that, but... You can swap the planes for DFAA? Well, I should have done that. Holy shit, how broken is the Gokase? 3,372 base XP. Wow. All right, well, for future, 
We are definitely going with DFAA because planes are useless. DFAA might actually shoot some down. What a... Thanks, game. Thanks. Thanks. I wish... Why can't it just tell me that I have progressed up the campaign when the game ends? Why is it got to wait? It's like, ah, now I'll choose my next ship. Boom. You're at 83 milestone on the campaign. Yeah, go cracked instead. I'm not being serious that it's broken. Uh, okay. Tier 7 or maybe Tier 6? What's at Tier 6? What kind of good, fine vessels could we play at Tier 6? Oh, here's one. Here's a good one. Maya. Yes. Speaking of IJN cruisers, why not? It's too late. It's too late. GOP cut? What the hell? Is the ship a Republican? Hmm. Oh, yep, I see you there. A Brutzi. Do we know, though, that there's any kind of incoming nerf? Why is somebody already saying, well done? Is it a salty, salty NC? Oh, G-O-P, Kase. Okay. Okay, lowercase g. Gop Kase. That does not roll off the tongue. Munchen. Don't worry about it, Brutus. It's just a German cruiser. Brutus just looked at me when I said München like, what? You know how dogs look at you and, it, and they're just like, what? I feel like I shouldn't shoot yet. Machine guns and missile launchers. Brutus, why do you have to hit your head on the microphone every time? You just like love to bonk your head right on the microphone. Oh, these torpedoes don't have any range, but I think now we can shoot at the munition. I feel safe. Shoot at the Talon, I guess. And then Munchen will see, and he'll be like, must kill. Yes. Oh, shit, that was North Carolina. Forgot about him. Hopefully I don't die now. Yeah, it's fine. The best thing about this little tier 6 cruiser is it gets a heal.
Go dark. Actually, no, we'll keep the guns this way. These torpedoes just don't have the range, but it's a Bayern. It's a Bayern versus NC. Need to turn away. Maybe these torps would have enough range. Um. I don't think we're gonna... What is our DD doing, anyway? Hmm. Okay. I think NC went the other way. Yeah, he turned around. Uh-huh. That's a strategic target. This turret traverse is slow, isn't it? Can this DD... I mean, I, I get if he was hesitant because there was a Talon hanging around, but there's not any more. Maybe he should go in the cap. Maybe I'll go in the cap. Because what's the NC doing? Yeah, I'll go in the cap. Maybe I won't. There's the Talon. Shoot at the Talon. Maybe even use one of these fancy reload boosters. Now that Talon is behind that island, I don't think he can probably hit me. Oh, shit. Um, okay. Well. That's fine, though. Brandenburg will probably be in Christmas crates in the future. I would, I would bet that is true. Okay, well, I guess we're gonna win this game. I think I might as well just take the cap. North Carolina's like requesting assistance. 
Little Benson. Good luck. North Carolina's pissed. Well, he's dead now, so he's not anything. What a sassy Benson we've got on our team. Very sassy Benson. I don't think the... Did the Italian Navy really get any applause in history? I don't know. I don't think they achieved much success. Great value, Jean Bar. Walmart, Jean Bar. Oh. I just realized a Mysore died. Somebody asked me to play that earlier and I didn't, so maybe we'll go there next. Why is their battleship all the way, like, over there? Or over there, I mean, by that island. Why is he all the way over there? What was he chasing? Oh, it's Cracciolo. Torpedoes? Detect is 9.7. What, Brutus? What? Jesus Christ, dog. Oh, there's a cruiser there, too? I guess those torps aren't going to do anything. Annoying. Yeah, well, we'll use. Oh, this is actually a close game. Guess I should be a little careful. Is Cracciolo just not gonna shoot? Well, while you're burning, Mr. Mysore. Oh, did he DCP? to kill the Mysore.
I think we're actually going to lose this game. Maybe not. That's gotta be annoying if you're the Caracciolo. Fuck, we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose. Unless I can kill this Caracciolo, that might give us enough points. Why is he turning his guns somewhere else? I don't think I can kill this guy before the game is over. Maybe. Double perma fire, will that be enough? Will it give us enough points to win? 673, I think so, maybe. Maybe that's enough. They got two caps now, I don't know. I think it's, it's probably enough, right? I think it's probably enough. Yeah. Well, that got pretty iffy. That got pretty dicey. I feel like I didn't really do anything in that match except stay alive. But sometimes that's what you gotta do, I guess. Hmm. Anyway, uh, what is tier five? Mysore, right? What is what is the nation? Da -da 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 Dunkirk B Aviary Duca Mysore is there it is. Okay. What's the deal with this thing? I don't know. Sonar smoke. That's the perma camo on the Mysore? Another gray. Well, I'm going to try this out and see. I think it probably sucks. I know it's a ship that they just sort of give away for free on WoW's PC all the time at the first possible chance, so that usually means it sucks. And sometimes they take ships that suck on PC and make them really good on Legends like Udachi, but I don't think that'll be the case here. A Nuremberg? No, it's British. It's like a Fiji, but missing a gun. Instead of a gun, it gets... AA turrets right there? That's okay. I never see this map. Does, this thing doesn't even have torpedoes. Does have a smoke screen though. Has it been a great stream? I don't know. I feel like most of the games have been pretty shitty. But thank you anyway. Yeah, Cyclone is not an impressive ship. So Bayern and all them are going toward Torpedo, but Belfast is coming this way. I keep pressing triangle like I've got torpedoes. I 
And I don't. Three ricochets, what? I would understand shatters, but ricochets. How much more broadside does he have to be to... Huh, okay. I think he's more like right there. Oh no, he's way over there. Oh no, he's way over there. Are there two ships in there? Oh, whoops. Is that just regular Belfast or is that, that's just regular Belfast, right? There is that Byron that went down this way, so this might be a bad move, but I'm going to do it anyway. Replays segment. I mean, I I did some videos from two other people this week. Hippers don't lie and three sit hit quiz. They both sent me some pretty good games in the Ruprecht and Columbo. I think that Fabuki's dead. Yeah. Oh my God, the CV. Oh shit. I think the base is fine, though, right? It was just the Fubuki, wasn't it? Oh, yes. Incredible damage to the CV. Apparently, zero damage to, like, New Mexico's and stuff, but to CV's. Oh, okay. Nope. Never mind. We're good. Is this one of those rolling smokes or crawling smokes or whatever? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Okay. So this is one of those quarter throttle smokes. Sneakily crawl away. It would be better if these guys were broadside. I don't know though, this AP doesn't really seem like British cruiser AP or anything. Seems like a regular AP. Oh, geez. I didn't realize my smoke screen was out there. I could be wrong, but. I don't know, it does not seem like. Very spicy AP power to me. Oh, there's the, uh, the Byron. Joining the battle, I see. 
And there's eight minutes left on the clock. What do we do, though? I don't... Yeah, I don't... I don't it definitely doesn't seem to get any kind of improved angles, because I was getting ricochets on a New Mexico. To be fair, I guess he was really far out there, but... British AP is a little better than that. Which I kind of don't understand then. Like if this, if I'm right and this isn't British AP, then why doesn't it get HE? What, because it's got a rolling smoke or whatever? There's plenty of cruisers with smoke screens that have HE. Shatter, shatter, shatter. Got to aim into the superstructure. Oh, he's stopping, I guess. I'm gonna go forward then. Wow, it takes three years to get the smoke back, I guess. Good thing the Bayern doesn't want to shoot at me. I guess he knows I'm not really a threat. Yeah, this is kind of a painful experience, I've got to say. Now, to be fair, I guess Byron armor is really, really stupidly strong, so maybe it's not a surprise that we're getting all these shatters, but it doesn't feel good. And it is a it is a good thing the Byron is just letting me do this with complete impunity. Cause I imagine this ship uh, blows up very easily. Oh now he's gonna shoot. I don't know. Does he get a bunch of damage? He's a Byron, so he misses. That's to be expected. That's the thing about the Byron. The Byron has stupid armor, but it's got terrible guns. It's not the Byron's armor, it's the AP. I kind of thought so when it was shattering against and ricocheting against the broadside of a New Mexico. It's not like that thing has armor. It's got like 25 millimeter plating or whatever. Yeah, I don't really understand the point of this thing. You're like a down-tiered Fiji, but... You don't have torpedoes and your AP is not really good. Hmm. Is this supposed to be an AA ship or something? Is that what the gimmick is? You've gotten Georgia out of a crate? That's pretty good. Yeah, I don't know. This, this ship seems pretty not good. AA is trash too. That's unfortunate considering it really looks like they sacrificed a... Uh, pretty sure there would otherwise be a turret where, right above where it says the name of the ship, but there's AA mounts there. I guess it gets the rollings or the crawling smoke, but meh. Is that all that great? Probably not.
It's a free ship. That's yeah, that's probably it. That's the gimmick. It does get heal. That is good. Is it a super heal, though? I'll have to look. Nobody, for whatever reason, wanted to shoot at me at all in this game, so... Can't really test it. Is in sight. Guess they all died. It is a super heal. That's good, at least. Not super? I have to look. Oh, Belfast. Does that say... Okay. I guess that's not the worst shell travel time. Yeah. No, that seems just like a regular heal. 152 HP per second. Doesn't the... Uh, does The Leander gets a heal, doesn't it? Right? That'd be like the only other cruiser at the tier besides Graf Spee. 206. Graf Spee's heal is better. Leander heal. What's that? 152. 152, and what was Mysore again? Was it also 152? So it's the same heal as Fiji. Is that a super heal, though? Maybe 152 is a lot at tier 5. I don't know. Same heal as, like, Fiji, though. Or not Fiji, Leander. Hmm. Well, anyway. Up to tier 7, I think. For the final couple games. I feel like Constellation might be a good one. Except we don't need Fighter Plane. I haven't played Constellation in a while. You got Sims out of a crate? Meh. Oh yeah, Al Grashpe does have that perk that you're. I think yeah. But in any case, the AP seemed really bad. Just seemed really bad. Hello, Phil. Three destroyers, the rest battleships and CVs. Oh my god. It's like the matchmaking of hell. Why is it so hot in here? Oops, messing with my thermostat app. Just realized the heat is on. That's why it's so hot in here. Sorry about this. Don't fucking shoot your guns for the love of God. Let me get back. Okay. Okay. 
Not radar. Well, okay, that actually worked out well. I meant to hit the plane, but I'll take the radar. I think we're gonna die. I fucked up. I think we're dead. Accidental radar turned out to be the exact right play for the moment. I don't think you meant to say you need intelligence data. Because you can see the summers. I think you meant to say he needed support. Yeah, that radar was completely accidental. I was meaning to hit the plane. See if I could get some vision of that Bismarck out there, but... Roma. What, Brutus? You want some food or something? Halfway decent hit in any case. Turn in a little bit, not die. Our team has taken the lead. Oh, okay, never mind. This entire time I was thinking the DD was still alive. I didn't realize he died. But I think after this, I think after this might be the last game of the night. Partly because I can't tell what Brutus is asking me. I don't know if he's wanting some food or wanting to go to a specific location. Aw, oh, come on. That could have been a kill. Eh, well. Three hours is about my limit, you know? And we just now hit that mark. But... But, well, I don't know. I'm not going to say what I was thinking. Uh, I probably don't want to give broadside to the Kansas. Bismarck, though. Don't really want to brawl in this thing. It's not really made for it. Hopefully Kansas doesn't wreck me right here. Ah, no. All right. That other battleship in the center has my broadside, which is not ideal. 
I guess Kansas just doesn't respect Constellation. Yeah. Oh, it was Roma. Right. Okay, do I get behind the island before Kansas gets the reload? I hope so. Oh. Well, hello there, Bismarck. I guess I'm lucky not to be dead. I feel like he might go forward. I think I am going to die here, though. I basically kind of thrown my ship away, to be honest. And Bismarck's not going to go forward. I hope that doesn't throw the game, but... Meh. I kind of... Whatever. Go to the French. I think that is going to be the end of proceedings for tonight. I feel like it's been just a series of terrible games. They haven't been... fun. Maybe Charles Martel will save things. I did send it. It was probably not the right idea to send it. Not in the Constellation. It just doesn't have armor. It does have magical guns, though. Oh, my f... F. Oh my god. This is the first time I've won most games. It feels like we've lost a lot. This is the first time I have seen this configuration of this map. This is awful. Who fucking thought this was a good idea? Who at Wargaming thought, yeah, let's take the higher tier ships, let's take a map and let's like shrink it to half its size and put it in high tier games. What, like, who thought this map, this was a good idea? Have they ever gotten positive feedback on one of the smaller map things that they've done? Has any has anybody ever said, yeah, I like that you've taken this map and made it smaller? I don't think anybody's ever told them that. How are we even supposed to play this? Are we all just supposed to go to sea because of this island chain? Like, this is usually in the middle of the map. There's not much to be done here. If you try to push in, you're gonna, like, if I try to push in, I'm just gonna die, because I'm a Charles Martel. The DD's not gonna go for the cap. How are, How is this even supposed to be played? I don't even know. I don't get it. I feel like smaller maps would probably encourage battleships to camp even a little bit more. Because where are they going to go without getting instantly focused? Well, at least we can shoot. Yeah, okay, so the entire red team went over this way. It, it kind of makes sense, because that's what the setup of this map almost incentivizes. It incentivizes everybody to go play... Because this is one flank of Estuary, it does sort of incentivize everybody to play this flank, and then I guess if they abandon the center like this, our DD can sneak into their base. It could present some interesting conundrums for them. I think I might as well just use the reload boost. All right, got my perma fire. Oh, Shaborg and Suzuya. Okay, can I just literally sit here and? Yeah, I guess I can. It's 
Is he reversing? I think he is reversing. Oh. It's dead Flanders coming through here. Battleship died, so whatever. Shoot at some more Flanders. Why is the Kagero screaming that he's spotted? There's only one possible way he could be spotted. And that's if he shot his guns. Maybe he did. Yeah, quicker reload of the main battery. Machine gun, Charles Martel now. Yeah, this has got to be... Probably one of the worst ideas they've ever come up with for a map configuration. Estuary is a fine... It's a fine map in its normal configuration. It's fine. This is... Uh, I think this map is, like, specially designed to facilitate these blowouts. Because, like, our team just sort of hung around and the enemy team pushed in and killed themselves. I think this map is gonna gonna result in a lot of blowouts. I don't know why they ruined it like this. This is bad. Shit, if I go into the dead center of this map, my gun range probably covers the whole thing. This is way too small for tier seven. Way too small. Hello, Spartan. Again, hello. Look at what they've done to your favorite map, though, Spartan. Look at this. Is that battleship? Can it shoot me? What is it? It's behind that rock. Oh, we're going to turn anyway. Tell your squad you're spotted when playing when you're located by the twisting track. It's kind of confusing though. Because like if you like if I was just a rando on your team and you're like we've been spotted in our DD in a place where you couldn't possibly be spotted, I'd be like, what the hell are you talking about? Maybe they should put something on the comm wheel that's like, oh, they're going to cap and this is over. Oh, no, this is not capture the base. I'm dumb. It's not over. There's three capture circles here. Why is, like... Flanders is, like, pushing into me, but he doesn't actually want to shoot at me. He wants to turn away from my torpedoes, though, and I've run out of map. I think the Charles Martel playstyle is on, honestly kind of impossible on this map, in this configuration. There's no way I make it to my last heal before I'm toast. There's the killing shot right there. Yep. 
Why did they do this? I just, I don't understand. It's so bad. Do we kill the Flanders? Maybe we kill the Flanders. Oh no, somebody, somebody took it. The Atlantico secondaries. And then the DD absolutely bitch slaps the battleship. But yeah, like, no room to kite, really. Can't really... This is not a good map design. They really just need to... to take this away. They could have kept the map full size and maybe tried to do something different with the cap circles, you know? They could have done that to make some sort of different scenario, but uh, to cut it in half like this, I don't know. Yeah, I've seen a couple Z52s in Vermont. These people really go hard on those bureau projects. Well, we do win this one at least, so that's good, but I don't know. I'll have to check and see how it was, because Iron Man said we won most of them, but I, I feel like we lost a lot. It would really suck with CVs. I just kind of want to see the results on this one before we end proceedings here. Oh, Kraken. Nice, nice. Dollars to donuts in the Atlantico. A Kraken. Somebody managed to get some good results out of this map. Oh, but apparently the Kagro's the real Chad. Or D-nuts to dollars, rather, not donuts to dollars. Hmm. Oh, well, that was a series of unfortunate games. Maybe that's what I'll call the next stream, series of unfortunate games. I have to remember that. That's a good title for a stream. So, let's see. Okay, well, there's four victories. Five, six. Sixteen games and th four defeats. Seventy-five percent, then? Okay. I guess we did win most of them. It didn't feel like that to me, though. It felt like, oh, man. Terrible. Yeah, he must have. Uh, he must have just secured the uh, Kagero's kills or something that Atlantico. But still, it's nice to get a crack in. Anyway, um, I might end up uh, actually streaming tomorrow for a little bit. We'll see. But tomorrow, um, Nick is gonna go play Dungeons and Dragons, and I've got nothing to do, so. I might stream tomorrow, or I might just tune in and watch MetaJerk stream. Who knows? Anyway, thank you all, and uh, I hope you all have a good weekend. If I don't see you tomorrow, then of course I'll be streaming. Well, I don't know. I don't know if I am going to stream tomorrow, so I don't know about the time. Before or after after MetaJerk. Um, I don't really want to stream at the same time he streams, because I'll probably tune in and watch that. So if I do stream tomorrow, it'll be before or after. I might, I only might. I'm, I'm not saying I will, I just might, because I've got nothing else to do. But uh, if I don't, I, have, I will, of course, be streaming again on Friday. Not necessarily at the same time, but same day. Anyway, um, have a good weekend, and maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye for now.